Hey guys, welcome and welcome back to another video. So today I'm back in Maple County and we will be looking at some secret locations in Maple County that you may or may not have known existed. So yeah, in this episode we will just be like going to secret locations that are in Maple County. They're either hidden or not hidden, although no one knows about it. So yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Anyway, so for the first location, it's a boat shop. So if you don't know already, if you go ahead and go to the port, this place isn't really that secret, but like, maybe most people, when it was their first time playing it, didn't know that I was here. And they like, and, and then they, or they weren't, started playing when there was no boat shop and never really came back to this location but basically if you come to the port down here which is where i'm at right now there's this blue warehouse so before there used to be nothing in this warehouse but i believe when the uh, ems updates came out they added the interior to this so yeah anyways if we walk into this uh, store you can see that there is a uh, boat and yes my game is lagging Sorry about the lag, uh, this uh, location is really laggy since you know there's so many assets, all these boats. So yeah, there's yachts, speedboats, and is this my friend? No, it's not. Yeah, speedboats, jet skis, banana boats, kayaks, canoes, there's all these kind of stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll just be right back guys. Anyway, so as I was saying... Yeah, so there's all these stuff fixed up. This location is really laggy, so I think I should probably get out before my game crashes. Anyway, so I got out of that boat shop. Oh my god, what is happening to my game? Anyway, so I got out of that boat shop before my game crashed. And my vehicle seems to be stuck. Let's see if we can get it unstuck. There we go. Anyway, so the sun is rising. I can turn my headlights off. Anyway, so the next location is actually a workplace. So not a lot of people know that you know, when they when I say workplace, they probably think of like the police station, the sheriff's office, the bank, or the donut store. But really, there is a secret workplace. Sadly, there is no job, but it would be cool. And really, it's just like an office inside a skyscraper. So yeah, that's really cool. Anyway, so if we drive down here. It is actually across the street from the skate park. So if we just come this way, uh, there's this building as well, which I'm not really sure what it is for, but it's closed right now. So yeah, you can see that there's this uh, box uh, metal building and then the skate park across the street. So if we just come in here, you're able to drive through this gate and then you come over here. So you can actually see that there's the interior. So there's an elevator and the stairs, and if you go up the stairs, I'm just going to take the stairs because it's faster, you're in this work office. So this is a really cool place that not a lot of people know about, and I think it, it should actually be like an office worker job in the future so more people actually know about it. But yeah, so there is like a office spaces over here, no cubicles, which is actually interesting. There's an office over here with really cramped seats, more desks, more desks, and some drawers. A like reception desk where like the employees can check in. And I think this is a reference to the office show. I'm not really sure. Anyway, so there, uh, this is like a bigger office. And then there's a meeting room over here. Sadly, you cannot see the outside probably because this is like a not even a connected location. They're probably in the middle of nowhere. And then yeah, there's an elevator here, so that's cool and all. And uh, if we go to the last location, which is actually a cliffside location, so if we leave this office building over here and then we go onto the Little Rock Highway, it's like a secret dirt path parking location that not a lot of people know about because like it's still off the main road. But if we basically come onto the east north side where it it's in the middle of nowhere basically so if we climb up this hill there's a lake to our left and if we keep on climbing this hill it should be right here so to your right you can see it's exactly on the corner so we can just turn in over here and of, and then here's where van man is so if he says he's on the cliffside then this is what he means so yeah there's this cliffside location 
Not even the police know about this, that's why Vanman never leaves this location. You can park your car, you can get out, there's like a ocean cliff view, and then there's also dirt paths which you can actually walk on, which is really cool. And then we of course have Vanman over here, he won't always be here depending on if the police found him or no. But yeah, so that's really cool. And anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.